Hello viewers, welcome to the another segment of microwave device. In this segment, we are going to discuss first trapped diode. I am Professor Aditya De, your mentor. So first, let us discuss the structure of the trapped diode. Trapped diode consists of the two layers of heavily doped P plus and N plus region, and a N doped third layer is used to separate the heavily doped. P plus and N plus layers, and let us discuss the operation of the diode. Diode is generally operated in reverse bias condition. This cause increase the E field or the electric field in between the P plus and N region, and the minority carrier is generated with a very high velocity. That is the structure. And the operating principle of the trapped diode. Now let us discuss the IV characteristics of the trapped diode. At the instant A, the diode current is on. Since the diode current is thermal and diode is reverse bias, it charges like capacitor due to the reverse bias condition. This charging of P plus and N region increases. The electric field above the breakdown. A heavy current is generated due to breakdown, and particle current inside the diode increases above the external current due to this E field or the electric field. Due to this electric field in the depletion region decreases. This drop in field is shown by the curve from B to C. During this period, the E field is so large, so that the avalanche continues and a dense plasma of electron and the holes is created. As some of the electrons and the hole drift out of the ends of the depletion layer, the field is further depressed and traps the remaining plasma. The voltage decreases to the point D, as shown in the figure. Till the total plasma charge is removed, the voltage increases to E, and once the residue electrons and holes are removed, the voltage is further improved to F. From F to G, diode charges up again like a fixed capacitor. Since there is no internally generated charge, voltage remains to G only. And the current to external circuit is zero. After half the period, the cycle is repeats again. This entire action of generation of the current through avalanche effect produces a pulse in the external circuit. Now let us discuss trapped diode applications. Trapped diode can be used in microwave beacons, local oscillator in radar. ILS that is instrument landing system, S band pulse transmitter for phased array radar, and radio altimeter. Let us discuss battery diode structure and the operating principle. First, we are going to discuss the battery diode structure. Battery diode basically consists of three layers. It has metal, N type, and the Metal structure, which is popularly known as MNM structure. The battery diode can be also consist of P type, N type, N type, P type of the device. That means it consists of PN and the NP type of the structure. Injected voltage and the current variation of the battery diode is as shown. This is basically a structure of a pulse. Now, here is a negative resistance. Why negative resistance? Because there is a decrease in the current with the voltage, as we have discussed earlier. This negative resistance means it can deliver the power. Now, let us discuss the application of the battery diode. It can be used in burglar alarm. It also can be used as an oscillator. 
Why oscillator? Because it can generate the microwave. If it generate the microwave range signal, so it is basically one kind of the oscillator. It is also used a small signal amplifier. That's all for this segment. Practice the structure and the IV characteristics of the diode repeatedly. This is very, very important for your exam. Thank you students. Bye.